What's up? It's Christian Stone Fox Media, and greetings to you all on this wonderful Tuesday. Gonna give you guys some uh, good gaming news to help get you through your day. So let's go ahead and get this started. So basically, Michael Patcher basically came out there and said Microsoft are preparing for a life after the Xbox, and it's the whole entire reason they bought Mojang. Now I know people maybe call it like Mojang or whatever they want to call it. To me, it's Mojang. And the reason why they bought Mojang for 2.5 billion dollars is because uh, they're getting ready to get out of the whole entire console market. So basically, they're gonna abandon ship. And then they're gonna head off and uh, you know focus on like casual gamers and their their tiny phones and all this other good crap and yeah that seems to be the way to go for them. So it's a smart buy for them, but technically I would have bought something way cooler. Now if y'all are gonna attack Microsoft for doing this, then you gotta attack Sony too because they're doing the PlayStation Now type thing too, where they're like, hey, what if this console thing isn't gonna make it? Well, I would say screw you all. Uh, consoles are gonna live forever. They will never die. Um, moving on from that news right now, uh, Sony, they basically uh, had a little bit of a leak on their website where they basically came out there and they had, uh, leaked Final Fantasy Type-0 HD secret PS4 titles for the Tokyo Game Show, which I will be trying to watch, you know, every single one of them. I think it starts on 18th, so I'll be watching every single one of them and giving you guys any good information if any, you know, comes out. But uh, one of the things planned is Destiny on one of them, so I'll miss that time slot. Um, but uh, moving on from that, uh, there was also another little tiny leak that happened or whatever that came out and it was um, from Guerrilla Games and their new game uh, Horizon and the concept art. It was all based on like gigantic robot dinosaurs, which is kind of weird, but I really want to see it. I would love to play a game with gigantic robotic dinosaurs. Like you wouldn't play it. Robot dinosaurs, like hopefully it's not like Titanfall with robot dinosaurs. But anyway, moving on from that news right now, uh, I came into a lot of fire for the video I made about the whole entire Destiny Bungie thing, and people are attacking moi. They're telling me I need to apologize, or apologize, and I really don't feel the need to. I don't think I, I gave them any kind of negative flack, I mean, except for the fact that they screwed up a lot. But other than that, I mean, there's also other articles that's going on right now where, you know, people are writing open letters to them saying they apologize for the people who love Destiny. And Destiny is by far a great game. It is a great game. I said go buy it. But I just said don't expect the game that you thought you were going to get. This is an open world MMO shooter. That's what you thought you were going to get, but you're not going to get it. So if you go into it with that mindset that everything you want, you're not going to get, then you'll be fine. <laughs> you will be fine. Uh, in a crazy PlayStation news, um, if anyone uh, thought that they had about a thousand uh, dollars or so that they had lying around, you know, you know, money you would pay bills with, you know, maybe get boats and hoes. I don't know, but that money shouldn't be spent on that. The hoes don't need money. What is needed is a pair of thousand dollar PlayStation Four shoes. So these uh, pair of Jordans are uh, $950 and yeah, they look pretty cool. Uh, they come with a little Jordan HDMI port and they have a PlayStation logo on the back. He's only gonna make 10 limited ones. So yes, get them if you can. This is like the coolest thing that I never ever wanted or will ever ever want. To me, it looks like he took a pair of Jordans, he took the back off, he mushed down some PlayStation 4 logo and then he sewed it back onto the back of the shoe. And he cut a hole in the back and he popped the HDMI port while putting a Jordan sticker on the back of HDMI. That's what it looked like to me. But you can buy it. I mean, you can be dumb as fuck and buy one of these useless ass pair of shoes. There it is. Well, that's all the news I got for you guys today. Like, subscribe, follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Facebook so you notice know as soon as my news becomes available. Thank you guys for watching, and I will holler at y'all later.